Well, Trev, these guys have absolutely turned it on this afternoon. It's been brilliant. The Rocket Robertson, he has just been super quick in the number 10 machine. Yeah, just you, you just think that uh, there's not going to be too much that's going to stop him from uh, picking up the first place trophy. Justin Randall, though, on the uh, Tirana on the outside. Good job from him. Keith Craft back there with Gary Cavilla. Bobby Ware, as they all close up, we are green for the feature race. 12 laps the journey as uh, looks like uh, Hayden Grants gets pushed away as he came out of the gate late. So he's uh, off to a long, long way back to try and catch the rest of the B graders. But Benny Robinson leads the A grade field from Justin Randall, Keith Craft, Gary Cavilla. And we go back to the 66. I think that's uh, Colin Morris. As uh, the B grade is being led at the moment by uh, by Dylan Craft. And look at Justin Randall taking the fight to Robinson. The track slick and dried off. And Robinson can't use all the available horsepower. Bobby Ware dropped back in the middle of the B graders. Dylan Craft's got a good lead over Mark Anderson. As the 86 turned right. Obviously something broke on that car for Elgin Dalton because it turned right straight into the wall up there in turn number one and we'll bring on the yellows with just two in the book in the open sedans feature race tonight uh, dnf for the cheaper skips falcon it's just a little bit of fluid coming out of the front mm. might end up in one of them skips macker dog oh, i was gonna say that but I <laughs> just just a thought. I was going to say, it's got craft racing on the back. I was going to say it was a bit crafty, but... <laughs> Come on, Mac. It's unlike you to hold off on no, that. No, look, I'm trying not to do the dad one joke, you know, the one-liners, trying oh. to behave myself. Everybody loves you for that, Mac. Okay, back to green. Ten to go on the BK trading board. Robinson leads the way. Randall's got a new lease of life with the track slicking it off as much as it has because Robinson cannot use all the available... Ponies on his right foot. Keith Craft in the 65 though, looking to take the fight to Randall. Craft sitting in third spot ahead of Gary Cavilla. Colin Morris under fire from the B grade car of Dylan Craft. Have a look at Dylan Craft giving Morris a hard time in the A grade sedan. Out of turn one, Bobby wears up on the cushion. Anderson's gonna drive the Falcon, the B grade Falcon underneath as Steph Manser gets uh, past either side by our first and second place runners. Gilston about to come under fire from Hayden Grants. Bob Ware goes back further through the field. Robinson though, leading this one. Seven left to run on the BK trading board. Oh, Hayden Grants throws it away in the Falcon. Down in turn four, will he bring on the yellows? The field rocketing around the leader. Up on the cushion is Grants. It is Benny Robinson. Yellows are out. We're going to get a restart this time around. Justin Randall, Gary Cavill has got past Keith Craft for third spot on the racetrack. Is he going to try and take the fight to Justin Randall? Colin Morris, misfire of plenty in the 66. Has Dylan Craft blow around the outside in the B grade Falcon. Mark, we up. Mark Anderson looking to do the same in the six. As the front three now close right up with six left to run. Justin Randall isn't out of this at the moment. But he's going to find it hard to try and make a straight line pass on the 10. Have a look at this. Randall on the inside in the Toronto. Robinson gets on the straight and just blows back by. But if Randall can get enough gap and slide up and take the line away from Randall, it could make it difficult for the race leader. Cavilla sits and watches this happen. Randall's got the lead now. If he slides up, Robinson looks to come back underneath. Randall says, not a chance. And Randall leads the Tirana. Down the back, Colin Morris, a lap car about to come into play. Robinson can't do anything about it. It's three to go. Cavilla sits in third. Morris needs to retire that thing before it throws a piston out the window. Keith Craft in 65. Oh, yellow lights are on. Randall didn't need that. 
Oh, oh, Dylan Craft has torn the rear clean off the Falcon. Oh, someone's lost a wheel. Oh, it's Crafty's wheel. Oh, there we go. That's what's happened. Crafty's, Crafty's turned it into a tricycle. Yeah, there we go. So the rear quarter panels come clean off the Falcon when the wheels parted company. Oh, you picked a fine time to leave me loose wheel. Sorry, Macker, I just had to say that. Hey, what a job it's, from Justin. It was either going to be you or me. What a job from Justin Randall. Hey, the Tirana leading Ben Robinson, who we all thought had this shot to pieces. But the track conditions not to the liking and the big horsepower in the 10 car. Randall, with a couple to go, leads down the back. The AFCO Shock Doctor, number 33, sponsored Tirana, leads. Here comes Kavila, found a lease of life in the feature race. Sits in third ahead of Keith Craft. Big gap back to the B graders, being led by Mark Anderson. Joel Gilston, as they all try and find a way past Steffi Mansa. A white flag about to come out. Morris is 66, is about ready to say, I've had enough. And he needs to bring it down before he pulls the yellow flag out. White flag one to go for Justin Randall out of turn two. Down the back for the last time. Robinson's got one last throw of the dice. He can't get the power down in the 10. And the Tirana's going to take an upset. Randall takes the win from Robinson. Kavila in second spot. Fourth is going to go to Keith Craft. Mark Anderson's going to take the win for the B-grade division. Second there will go to Joel Gilston ahead of Hayden Grant. Steffi Mance is going to round out the field. Oh, Benny Robinson says, oh, look, I could have put the power down. <laughs> Too late for that, son. The checkered flag's thrown and gone. Oh, folks, what a great drive. Put your hands together for the little Tirana of Justin Randall. Keep the applause going for our B Greg winner and Mark Anderson. Rest of the field. Rest of the field makes their way back across the crossover into the pits. Justin Randall pulls up the AFCO Shock Doctor sponsored Tirana. We are positive that's the old Mike Vine. I'll, I'll ask the question. Make it quick, big fella. Well, Justin, congratulations to Tirana. Too much horsepower in the 10 to uh, contend with the track conditions. Well done. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, little car just got on the bottom and could stay there, but she was pretty pretty gone, the track, compared to what we were expecting, yeah. Congratulations, buddy. Quick question is, is the old Mike Vine Tirana? Nah, no, nah, it's mine. I built it. Yeah, there we go. See, you're wrong, Macca. Well done, buddy. Congratulations. There he is, our feature race winner. And winner for the B-grade division, Mark Anderson. Unfortunately, Crafty didn't like having the right rear wheel on. He turfed it. Nah, gave, you, gave you the win, mate. Yeah, well done. Well done. Thank you very much. Congratulations on your first win in B-grade. Well done, buddy. Thank you very much. There is Mark Anderson, winner of uh, B-grade.